okay? Uh, and this is a good time to actually bring up a question that was asked, um, I believe, on my TradingView stream, which is, you know, differences in log scale and arithmetic scale, right? So basically FX for the most part, um, if you're looking at any sort of intraday chart, uh, you know, even probably say action over the last week or so, uh, maybe even the last you know couple of months, it's probably not going to matter a whole lot uh, because the percentage moves are going to be rather small compared to say equities uh, or even some commodities. However, when you're looking at a very long term chart, in this case, we're looking at, you know, cable back to 2007 high. So you're looking at, you know, 210 down to 130 or sorry, 115 or so. That is a big move, right? So I just as a default, I tend to look at uh, log scale, but I will, you know, toggle back and forth. Um, so when you're looking at log scale, you're looking at percentage moves, right? So you're comparing apples to apples in terms of uh, percentage moves when the market's you know going from one to uh, 1.05 or you know going from 210 to you know 220 or something uh, the percentage moves the same so if I were to put up say arithmetic scale you can see that it's just in um, you know the the y-axis I should say is simply uh, evenly spread out right because each move whether it's 170 to 180 or 180 to 190 it's all gonna be the same uh, so in you know simple terms, it's you know it's it's percentage change uh, for log scale and arithmetic scale is just uh, the change in the number, right? Not percentage. So I tend to look at log scale um, so I can compare. You know the moves are similar whether you're looking at uh, you know higher high, higher numbers or lower numbers. So as you know uh, or should know. I am uh, working with Scandinavian Capital Markets as the chief technical strategist. Uh, we're based in Stockholm. Uh, Scandinavian Markets is a market maker. And we are looking for profitable traders to join our ranks. We have clients all over the globe uh, that are looking for more strategies to invest in. So if you are a profitable trader and you would like to get into the money manager world, um, you know, all goes according to plan and things go well, you can get your, uh, you know, you can get your strategy funded with up to $2 million. Okay. So come and show us your skills, uh, to register, go to Scandinavian markets.com slash fund my trades. Again, that is Scandinavian markets.com slash fund my trades.